You guys, can you even believe it? I'm at the thrift store right now. I haven't made a thrift with me video in quite a minute, and I'm so happy to be back with this because I have been dying to go with you because it's just not the same. I don't know. I usually go thrifting by myself, and if I'm not with Jared or my sister or my mom or something, um, I really like to enjoy being with you guys. Um, I really like to enjoy it. Yeah, you know, um, I'm really happy to be here right now, and we're going to look for some things. You know, I don't actually have a plan right now, so let me think of something that I wanted to thrift for. I had a few different ideas, and I was like, maybe I want to thrift thrift 2022 trends and I kind of still want to do that so maybe that's what we're going to do today I know I'm looking for like a pleated skirt um pleated maxi skirt or like a silky looking maxi skirt um or midi midi maxi you know like not, I don't want midi because like mid calf but like I want like a little bit lower than mid calf um very specific but you know I will say I am pumped up because I did just listen to Bridget Mendler and like I don't know what it is, but Bridget Mendler gets me going. Like, I was listening to a bunch of other music that, like, is my happy music and gets me excited. But the Bridget Mendler, what was the song? Hold on. I can't ever think of the name. Oh, Hurricane. And you know what gets ingrained into my head is, like, the last um, portion of the song where the, where she's, like, harmonizing. And it's like, who? I You know what would be so epic if I could find a pair of metallic pants at the thrift store? Um, just fun pants in general. I'm looking for jeans, um, black jeans specifically. A little bit baggier. I hope, I'm hoping I can find like one size bigger maybe because all of, like vintage jeans especially, if I can find one size lower, I think they'll fit perfectly. Um, I'm sorry, one size bigger than they'll fit perfectly. And then as far as colors go, I'm looking for like reds. Um, I'm looking for like creams and ivories. I really have been liking the ivory shade like white I like but it's like kind of almost like this it's like a beigey white um brown colors like rich chocolatey browns but also like a light cognac brown I don't know if I'm saying that word right and then also electric blue you guys know I'm obsessed with electric blue everything I'm wearing lately um a corset top I've been really really wanting to find at the thrift store because it's like I refuse to buy it online even though I found so many amazing ones online but I'm like I feel like that's something I could thrift so why not try that first um so I'm gonna do that glitter and sequins bags things of that nature just sparkles in general sparkles give me so much serotonin um it's almost as good as hurricane by Bridget Mendler like that's what sparkles do to me to find a quilted jacket uh, I keep seeing everyone in those see New York jackets and I'm like and I have seen people thrift quilted jackets and I'm like to be so lucky, I would love to do that. So we're gonna go on there with a good positive attitude. We're gonna manifest this quilted jacket um, or a quilt to make a jacket. But the thing is, I'll never make it. I always say I'm gonna make it and then I never do. I don't have anything purple in my wardrobe and I feel like that's a big color that I think I'm, we're gonna see more throughout the year, like this lilac or like really bright purple. And I would really like that because I like that paired with other bright colors like yellow, a purple and yellow combo with this color of yellow with purple. I love it. A matching suit is also on my list, like a baggy matching suit. Um, shorts, pants, whatever the case is with the matching blazer, you know? Oh my God, okay, we gotta go on. It's so loud out here, um, but here she is in all of her beauty. Ooh, also capes are on my list, a cape. Um, I think that was in one of the articles, I think it was Harper's Bazaar, that I saw them talking about capes being super big and I just got one, but um, I have like a different material one. This one is kind of more of like a snuggy. it reminds me of more. Let me make sure I have my keys. That's my wish list, let's go in. All the snow is melting, finally. So now it's just puddles, so I'm wearing these. Okay, found some capes. Well, they're not really, oh, I think that's a skirt. Okay, no, wait, that's a skirt. But this, I think this is in like the cape realm. I like it, but I don't know if I'm looking for stripes or not right now. Um, so we're gonna start here. The jacket section, you guys know. You guys, this is the thrift store that I get in trouble in. Okay, well, I, I talk like my mom when I say that. It's like I get in trouble because I, <laughs> I spend a lot in here, but it's like this thrift store has all of the good things always. So I always know when I'm coming in here to be prepared to have to say no to a lot of things. So let's hope for that energy today. Um, I feel like this is the color of brown that I'm looking for, except for not in this material. Um, let's see. It's a nice wool coat. I like that. So if I don't need any more wool coats, I'm moving on to spring jackets. You know, I have to stop myself at some point. I feel like the music just got louder as I got in here, but um, I did find, hold on. I'm also looking kind of like, for, why am I doing that? For denim? Um, I bought a denim jacket on eBay, but well, I actually bid it on it. I don't know if I got it or not. Um, so we'll see, <laughs> see but um, I'll see, see, this is kind of like quilt cool looking. Not what I'm looking for, but it's kind of cool. <laughs> 
Okay, the music got way too loud, so I just decided to do voiceover. But look at this. I love the texture on it. Um, and I think that if it had a different, like, silhouette to it, I would have really liked it a lot more. But, and then this purple thing. Gorgeous. Again, gorgeous. And I think that I actually could find ways to style it. Um, and then this plaid right here. I've been really into plaid. And I think that this specifically would be so perfect for mixing patterns with. Um, to pull, like, a, a similar pattern or color from her with polka dots even. Like, not with that, but, like, with polka dots. I feel like it could look cool. Anyway. The music's on pause, so I'm going to do this fast. Look at this. I really like the cargo kind of utility style to the shirt. Um, and I feel like it would be really cute as, like, a monochrome outfit with, like, cargo pants. I don't know. Am I, is that stupid? I kind of like it. In the cart she goes. Our first one. <laughs> I also think this cardigan is, like, super nice and simple. You guys know I've been into cardigans lately. And just, like, if I were to leave that open with a t-shirt on under it, I don't need another gray cardigan. But, you know, I just wanted to point that out. But I feel like it's super nice to just layer um, in the spring with them. I don't know, maybe. Something that I realized when looking for like these button down shirts is that I now pay attention to the sleeve length, especially because you can't try them on. Um, so this one I can just tell is a little bit too short. And then also the buttons. See, these have good buttons, but I've gotten so many before that are like this and have these buttons and I never like the way they look. They just, I don't know what it is, but something about the buttons make a huge difference to me. Um, and so that's what I kind of look for now when I'm going through them. Also, like, this part, if it's too long or too short, sometimes they're really way too short. Um, and so I try to pay attention. And also the detailing. Sometimes I always miss, like, this detailing, and I don't always want that. I kind of want it to just be, like, super simple. Um, except for I do really like that, but... It's a little tidbit of what makes me... I don't know if that you guys like to hear those things, but, um, what makes me decide against something that I'm kind of looking for because I am this close this close to buying the Jerf Avenue um button downs because they look so good I think it's the brazy shirt or something from them I love them so much but my whole for you page on TikTok is filled with Jerf Avenue hauls and I'm gonna be I'm gonna eventually but I always like to check because you just never know if I can find something super similar like I want the exact same like boxy fit look also I've been into red lately um, I think I mentioned this somewhere, but for the past, all of my adult years, so when I turned 18 or 17, I started working at Target, and I worked there for about five years, and so I've been scarred in the color red. I've just hated it. I don't know what it is, because that's what I had to wear every single day, um, and so, and now that I'm not forced to wear it to work every day, um, because I don't work there anymore, obviously, uh, I can appreciate it again. I'm starting to ease back into it and like it a lot more, so I found a couple of red pieces. And honestly, my Zoe Kravitz video really inspired a lot of this because of like, you can wear it in a very Wait, can easy I way. You, oh. you can wear it, I feel like, in a very easy to look at way. Um, this is like a linen. I don't know if you can tell, but it's like a linen piece. And I really like just the simplicity of it. Um, and then this I really love because I always love red and white striped pieces. And this is kind of the exact shape I'm looking for. Um, and I feel like it would be cute even just buttoned up with like a pair of jeans and <gasps> my Mary Jean flats. Wait, that would be cute. I'm sorry, that would be cute. No look for the corsets. Um, but, however, I did find, wait, not that, this. And I really like the colors in it. I'm not going to get it because I know myself I won't wear it. But I really like this color combo. And then this, I thought was just cute. Again, wouldn't wear it. But I feel like in someone's closet, that could be super cool. I don't like these. Is that weird? They're old navy. They're just like the basic cargo pant, but I feel like this could actually be really cute dressed up. Fight with me in the comments if you think that I'm totally going crazy because I don't know, something about them. I'm really liking like the cargo style right now. Um, and I've been kind of trying to find the pair. Um, and these just, these just feel really nice. And like, I like the color of them. So I'm gonna hold on to them, see how much they are. $3.99. Um, that might be a yes. Okay, this is a sleep dress. It's like this thermal material, but I kind of love it. I don't know. It has shoulder pads. That's kind of funny. Maybe it's not a sleep dress then. I wouldn't think. You guys know how I've been talking about the silver pants or like the fun pants? I feel like you could find some in the pajama section just a pair of satin pants and get the same look and vibe like if these were a different color i feel like that would be perfect um and they're super inexpensive like that okay i'm in the men's section i hopped over here really quick and 
and uh, I just found these. They're Club Monaco. I think they're men's pants. Yeah, 32s. But they would be so perfect. Again, they're not my size. But wait, <gasps> these might be Jared's size. Hold on. I kind of like those for him. But I was thinking even for me, I feel like that could be cool. Kind of like the cargo style. I guess I'm really into it right now, apparently. <laughs> hey, wait, but how perfect is this waistline? Again, too small, but I feel like they'd be perfectly high-waisted. And this is what I'm kind of looking for in my next pair of trousers I find at the thrift. Um, but I love that, because look at... They kind of remind me of the picture Emma Chamberlain was in lately with, like, um, Chamberlain Coffees that she was, like, in the streets of New York. I don't know, I like them. Look at these. These are kind of cool. They're Adidas. And they're like this, um, very, very thin material. Almost like a corduroy, but not really. It's, like, super thin and lightweight. Um, but I've never seen them by Adidas, and I really like them. They're size 12. But I think they'd be really cool. Um song is intense for the thrift store. Another kind of thing I think will continue to get bigger are these striped pants. I just think they're cozy and comfortable. These are by Alfred Dunner. I bet you could find those on like eBay or something. Now that I know the brand name, that's so helpful. Also, kind of this plisse e ish esque fabric. I love these. I love textured pants, and these are like super textured. Um, and beautiful. I just love the shape. Wish they were my size. Um, color is amazing too. I like the color. I like that it's like a super baby blue stripe. I like that. Now, if I'm being honest, I'm kind of not feeling the clothes right now. I want to look through the home stuff, so hopefully you guys don't mind. Um, but I'm just going to peek around at this and then go look at the accessories and the shoes. But here we are. How beautiful. That's so cute. I love that. Also, please look at the detail in this plate. It's like textured, hand painted. This is gorgeous. Very, very beautiful. There's a set of two. Oh, look at that. That was the little. Nice. I love checking out the books because, first of all, this is cute just to have sitting out i like the colors a lot um but it just sounds cool um and then this one i have like a matching one of this and so i was like you know what maybe i could use that as decor is that bad to buy these as decor Some, is something wrong with that but i don't know i just think that they're <laughs> cute and you take this off you can see it how pretty it looks i love when they look like this and so that's what i usually buy them for i skim through them okay i skim i don't just waste the knowledge Okay, this is cute. Very cute. Also cute. Also cute. Love that. I love mugs, and I love this mug. I think I might grab this. I collect for no good reason, other than I just love using cute mugs. I'd much rather buy, like, fun ones like this. This looks like something that I feel like small brands right now would make. I think that's adorable. I like that. Also, I did think that this said frizzy, and I was like, oh, I might need that, but then I was like, no. Because, you know that TikTok sounds like, you are, God, what is it? It's sassy and frizzy, and I don't like you at all. Um, yeah, that's what made me think of it. Anyway, let's look at the glasses. This is amazing. This is a mug. How cool. This is cute. Very cute. How nice is this wreath? Another easy way I think you can bring that element of like sparkle and metallic is like a thrifted bag. Like something like these. Like those look like the pants that I have. You guys know the ones. Um, but see they have a bunch here. I love that. And you can just add a little bit of a sparkle to your outfit. Doesn't do too much. Doesn't take away from the outfit or anything. I like that.
love this red orangey bag. Nine West, cute. I love that. These slipper insert things kind of remind me of the Prada boots that are out right now. I think Dior has them too. And the dresses, look how sweet. I love the little sweetheart neckline. I don't like anything else really about it. I mean, I like the, I guess everything except for this part, but um, I like the neckline though. It's very cute. I mean, this is kind of a cute dog bed. I think it's too small for Felix and I don't know if Rex would use it because he likes the floor, but that's cute. Like I would recover that in like a striped pattern. How much is it? 20 bucks, okay. Oh no, 16, cute. Look at this brown leather skirt. Very cute, love it. Um, okay, I'm just peeking through the skirts. I really wanted to find, I like that with the pleating, um, but I'm really trying to find you know, a midi skirt that can be worn, you know, with anything really. How beautiful is this? Vintage Express, gorgeous. This is exactly what I'm looking for, but a different size and it has new with tags too. The old Express uh, tag there, love that. Right, in the pajama section, I just saw these. They kind of remind me of the bloomers that I think will be super big in the summer. Um, like, more toned down version, you know? Just with like the simple lace detailing. Call me a weirdo, but I kind of like these just casually with like any outfit. Even those, I am a weirdo. Or I know, I don't know. The irony of me trying things on in front of the locked off fitting rooms. You know, I think I quite like this. I'm not, I'm not sure. Okay, I'm sorry. I do like this though, but I don't know, honestly, because of this. Will this little detail stop me from wearing it because I'm a picky brat? No, I don't know. Yes, I kind of like that it's sheer. I feel like this will be nice in the summertime too, with like a short set or something, I don't know. On this either. Uh, let me know what you think again down below. Yes or no. Like picture it with tan pants or tan trousers. Kind of like opened up with some booties maybe. I don't know. Please look at these Gabrielle Union like NYC or NYNC pants I found like with the low crotch. I think those are so cool. These are my mom would love these. Wait she might like these. Hold on. Let me send her a picture. Why do I kind of love this windbreaker? I have enough windbreakers, but I kind of love it. Also like this, this is like a dupe for the Patagonia um, fleece vests that I see, like the Retro X ones. <laughs> a good shape in a leather jacket. Okay, it's the next day now. Hi, hello. Um, I look a little rough right now. I, I had a dentist appointment earlier and I had to get a tooth pulled, so um, I'm a little swollen and I mean, stuff is wearing off, so excuse that and my makeup's all over the place, but I wanted to film this for you because um, I just finished editing the video. I'm really excited because, again, uh, let me reiterate it again, I'm very excited. I love filming Thrift With Me's. Um, I just don't get to do them that often, but I wanted to show you, and you know what? I only got four things. I literally spent like $15, which is like record breaking at the thrift store for me, especially lately. Um, but I found these like trousers and and I have a few pair that I've been looking for online the, um, on Essence and they're in my cart staying there and I'm like, you know what, if I can't find a pair at the thrift store, then I'll do that. But I'm really, really trying so hard because obviously a thrift store pricing um, would be a lot better than, you know, especially Essence pricing. But um, I got this for $4. They're size 41, so I'm hopeful that they'll be good. I don't know, but I've realized the ones that I've found online um, that are brand new seem to like don't have any like cuffings on the bottoms or notice especially in the men's section when you're looking at trousers a lot of them have like the folded over cuffs um that are you know secured and sewed so i found these and they weren't and they look like tailored so i'm like you know maybe they'll work 
So we're gonna try these on because I don't know how they're gonna work. Okay, wait, I don't know how to show you these. Okay, wait, can you see these, you guys? I'm impressed. I like them. I think that they fit perfectly. Actually, like for like a nice tailored pair of trousers, if I wanna wear them, like I feel like with a blazer, that would be really cute or something. Um, throw on this matching blazer, sorry. I'm like a mess. You guys have to look at this closer. Do these not look like they match exactly this blazer and the pants? They're the exact same colors, I think. Jesus, this outfit. Like the whole outfit, even the sweater. I don't know, I like it. Um, I'm definitely into these pants. These are probably my best trouser finds at the thrift store. Okay, another pair of pants that I found are these like terry cloth kind of, just like loungewear pants. And to be honest, they kind of reminded me of something that Donnie would put out, which is my favorite loungewear company. Um, and kind of something that I could see Matilda Jerf in, in summertime with like a bikini top and like a button down opened up with braids or something. I don't know. I just really like them. They look super high waisted, so I want to try them on. Um, but again, they're just like this almost terry cloth material and they're only $2. And again, I just know that I'm trying to think for myself in the spring and the summer. So I think that these will be good. Let's see. Okay. Yes. These are going to be perfect. You see that? I love them. Um, I really like the color. Bathing suit, going for a little boat ride or something. I don't know. That's just how I'm thinking. But then I also have had two tops, which you guys already know one of them. Oh wait, no. I only have one top and the rest and the other thing is just a pair of pants. Okay. So then I did end up getting this because Again, I don't know, it's just perfect. When you find a good striped piece, you're like, I don't know, at least I'm like, I have to get it. So I have a tank top on. Oh, okay, this is so up my alley. I love this, it's so cute. I feel like I'm gonna get so much wear out of this because again, even like just um, buttoned to here, let's say, let's gather it up. Like imagine a good pair of like dark wash denim. That could be cute. I don't know, something about red and white stripes too. Um, I'm just super into and like the colors of this outfit or something is definitely giving me Miranda Sings vibes, but you get the vibe, right? Like, again, even just like open with a little tank top on under it, not this tank top, but a tank top. Lastly, lastly we have the cargo pants, only me cargos. Jared was so in shock. He was like, I would have never bet money on you getting a pair of joggers ever because I've always been like, He's like been like, oh, those are cute, like when we're out shopping and stuff. And I've always just been like, no, I don't like them. And now here I am trying them on and they fit perfectly. So I specifically saw this one picture. I think it was on Who What Wears Instagram. And they it was very utilitarian style. Utilitarian? Very utility style outfit, like the jacket and the pants and stuff. And I just saw the cargos and I was like, I, I had already been thinking about them for a long time. And I was like, I like that. I like that outfit. Um, I have those shoes. I like the whole outfit. And so I was like, when I saw these, I was like, you know, I think it's perfect for them. I like the fit. I think they're cute. Again, it's a little bit outside of my comfort zone. Um, but I'm going to try out a trend or like a thing. Cause I don't know if these are trendy or not, but, um, I'd rather it be at the thrift store. So I'm really glad I found them here. So anyway, that is my haul. My fourth thing haul, but again, I'm trying to be more selective, especially at the thrift store, because I've talked about this in every single one of my closet clear outs is that I, I'm a psycho at the thrift store. I lose like all of my brain cells when I all walk into a thrift store. So I'm trying to regain those brain cells and think about the things that I'm buying. So I don't have to do these big closet clear outs. And I want things that I'm going to like for a long time. Um, staples in my closet, that kind of thing. So I hope you guys don't mind, um, which is also why I don't go thrifting that often um, because of that reason as well. But I hope you guys enjoyed this. Nonetheless, thank you so much for hanging out with me. You go. I know a lot of you guys like the thrift with me's, so make sure you're subscribed down below and put the um, little bell on, and then you'll get notified every time I post. You'll know when I do post a thrift with me or a video that you'd be interested in. So um, yeah, I love you guys so much. Bye.